2024 Hyundai Santa Fe is a bold SUV that's not afraid to be different. Hyundai is giving us our first look at the new Santa Fe, which receives a bold new look for its next generation. For the first time since 2018, the Hyundai Santa Fe is getting a meaningful redesign, and it's a big one. The new model features boxy proportions and styling details reminiscent of Land Rovers, new H-shaped headlights, and a more premium look that Hyundai says is optimized for outdoor lifestyle enthusiasts. Described as a radical departure from the existing model, the fifth-generation Santa Fe will be fully revealed in August. For now, the automaker is just showing off the new design of the crossover, which it says was shaped by big data around the latest outdoor trends. The all-new Santa Fe is an SUV that finds a perfect balance between city life and the great outdoors, handling everything from busy family itineraries to car camping adventures, said Sang Yup Lee, head of Hyundai Global Design Center. With its longer wheelbase, roomy interior and terrace-like tailgate space, the new Santa Fe leans into its SUV strengths to offer more versatility than ever before as well as a premium customer experience. The new front creates a sense of grandeur, Hyundai says, and is defined by its H-shaped DRLs, the H motif on the lower grille that are a reference to the automaker's H emblem. The shape is continued at the rear, to unify the two ends of the crossover, but the area is simpler overall. Hyundai says that was done intentionally to balance the exterior design. Meanwhile, sharply defined wheel arches help mark this out as a capable vehicle, and the 21-inch wheels give the new Santa Fe a robust look. The automaker says that the fifth-generation crossover has a long wheelbase and wide tailgate to offer owners plenty of cargo space. Although it has not yet revealed just how much volume it will have inside, the fully foldable second and third row seats will provide class-leading interior space, it claims. A refined interior. In contrast to the stark, structural exterior, the interior is intended to be refined and open. The H shape from the outside is continued inside, and helps the designers emphasize vertical and horizontal lines to suggest openness and volume. Brightly colored seats and headliners further help make the interior feel spacious, and fine materials, like soft touch wood patterned garnishes or delicately embroidered seats give the Santa Fe a more refined feeling inside. As a modern vehicle, it will also have plenty of tech, of course. A curved display connects the 12.3-inch digital cluster and infotainment system that will greet drivers, improving visibility out of the vehicle and giving it a luxurious look. Powertrain Options While Hyundai did not offer any technical details, the 2.5T badge at the back confirms that it will get a turbocharged 2.5-liter four-cylinder engine which produces 277 horsepower and 311 pound-feet of torque in the current Santa Fe. A hybrid variant will also be available in North America. In Europe, expect the SUV to be offered with a 226 horsepower 1.6 liter TGDI hybrid inline 4 turbo and a 261 horsepower plug-in hybrid variant. Unfortunately, we'll have to wait a little bit longer before we find out more about the next-generation Hyundai Santa Fe. The automaker says it will fully reveal the new crossover on its YouTube channel in August.